Coach, a week ago, your message to your team was, let's slam this door and not make it too chaotic at the end. Well, your team did that today. Really, regardless, how proud of you are, are you of this team and how they've really been able to answer your message, it seems like, each and every week? Well, I think they've done a great job of responding, uh, responding as a team. And obviously, uh, feel terrible for losing uh, keys. Uh, but you know what? This team rallied. And uh, it's great to get this win. Uh, you know, we had, I told them before the team, you know, before the game, you know, hey, uh, I only want reasons why we're going to win. And uh, that's what they did today. And they, they laid it out on the line today. You know, they take your cue from that. But knowing it's been a tough 10 days, you know, I think you don't want to minimize it and, and, and act like you haven't lost anything because you have. But knowing all of that, what's it say about your group that Youngstown State comes out, they punch you in the mouth, kind of similar to last week, and then after that, you really were able to respond. Yeah, and they did a great job responding. Uh, I can tell you this, uh, there's no one more happier than this win than Jaquan Keys, you know, and what he's given this program. And uh, it was just a tremendous win. Uh, these guys responded. This is not an easy place to win. And, uh, and we were able to come here and do that. They were 15-3 and three in this building over their last 18 games, and they've won over 75% of their games in this building. But what was it about you guys offensively that were able to pass the ball with as much success? Because in recent weeks, Youngstown State gave up a combined in the last three games, 341 yards passing. I can't remember the total of today, but what was it about your – I know a lot of it was – your quarterback and having a great wide receiver and Dante Hendricks and a cast of others, but what was the key to that today? Well, I think protection too, and I'm always going to start up front. And uh, obviously, uh, Ryan did a tremendous job getting the ball out and getting the ball in the hands of our wide receivers, and they made some great catches. Uh, Dante had a career day, and uh, you know it was really good to see. You know he. Uh, he made some unbelievable catches, shows that he's a, a big, big time receiver in this conference. You play defense, so I know you're a big defensive guy. What did your defense really say today? It seemed like they were able to pressure the quarterback quite a bit with not really bringing a lot of blitzes today, uh, but also able to not really let them move the ball with ease after that first drive. Well, I think they did a great job of staying together. You know, they made some adjustments early, tightened down, and just played good swarming defense. And that's what this team lives by. They fly around to the football, uh, keeping the ball in front of us. We let one get out on us on a run. We'll get that cleaned up. But for the most part, they uh, they tightened down and played really good defense. What's this win mean? Well, I mean, we got to keep it going. You know, we got an awfully good South Dakota team coming. Uh, come to Terre Haute next week. We got to get back to work and uh, uh, try to get to three.